The exhibits at this Nigerian museum are, quite frankly, rubbish. Recycled rubbish, to be exact. This is the Waste Museum in Nigeria's third biggest city, Ibado, home to art and objects made from discarded cocks, bottle caps, and fabrics. It was created by Jumoke Oluwakiri, who says it's the first of its kind in Africa. She was first inspired when she realized her landlord was going to increase her collection bill because of the amount of waste generated from her home. Her response was to start piling it in the corner and to read up on how to reduce and recycle. So I'm always like, what can we do with this thing? Why do we have to throw this thing away? Why must it end up in the dustbin? Why must we throw it in the landfill? So I always you know, want to challenge myself to see what I could come up with using the waste. She's one of a growing number on the continent making art on fashion from rubbish to highlight damage being done to the environment. While Loa Kerry was showcasing her recycled art, UN member states were meeting in Kenya's capital, Nairobi. There are green plans for the first global treaty to tackle plastics pollution. If we cannot define where our waste is going to and what that waste is being used for, then we have not started. Because it's not enough for you to just pick the waste, drop them on the landfill and say, oh, that's it, final, oh, bye-bye. The former visual arts teacher stocks her museum with works of other artists, as well as her own pieces made with waste material she collects from people's homes and picks off the streets. As well as running the museum, she also makes equipment for school playgrounds. 